Hey beautiful Sagittarius, welcome back to the channel everyone. I hope you're doing fabulous. Thank you so very much for joining me here. Guys, you've been through so much Sagittarius, good and bad. So let's see what spirit has for you today. Trust. Solitude. Truth. Oh, some potential for abundance here. What is going on? And trust that there is an opportunity for um, abundance, inner peace, growth, change, actions, things being illuminated. Go with the flow. This is transformation. Oh, jeez. So it's to do with stability, having patience, and going forward, Sagittarius. Blessings. Blessings in disguise. Let's go, Saggy. Trust. Have trust. Sagittarius. Letting go and trusting, finding your way, your truth, your authenticity. So you could have gone through a life review or someone is going through a life review. This is a rebirth. In sanctuary, finding your eternal self, your true self, your authentic nature. Hmm. Inspiration. What's going on? Moving forward? What is this? Someone's very angry about a relationship moving forward. Oh. Being recognized. Ten of Pentacles. Holy shit. Hidden treasures, hidden blessings. Trusting your intuition here. Oh my God. Trust. There is regret here. About a relationship. Something you could have waited for for a long time. This is karma. This is success. This is good fortune, Sagittarius. Oh. Oh my God, Sagittarius. These are prayers, inspiration. Somebody's inspired. You've inspired someone, Saj. 
So there has been some blockage in communication. But you are getting karmic justice somehow. Authenticity. Your truth. Just trust. The truth will all be illuminated, Saj. Okay, so there's been distance. Someone feels foolish for getting caught in a karmic cycle. This is an awakening. Oh my good God. Courage, strength. Okay, there seems to be a blessing here. Someone hating that you've walked away. What's going on? This is getting recognition, high honor, respect. Speaking the truth, your authentic truth. Oh. Someone is bitter, someone is angry here. Hang on. It's to do with family. Someone's been lying about um, a father. Wait. Sagittarius, you've taken the blame for something. You've taken the blame. You've been made the scapegoat. You have taken the blame for something, but someone wants you to know. I don't know if this is your father or a male figure. Um, they may or may not be here anymore. They want you to know that you're going to be vindicated and they want you to like Someone wants to come toward you and someone is deliberately blocking communication. We're getting this a lot. Someone is deliberately blocking communication between you and someone else. And this could be family. It, you've been made the blame or the scapegoat for something you're not guilty of. Let's just see. 
someone creating like some sort of hatred. Let's find out what's going on here. Sage. Altering your values and morals and making life decisions. Unexplained body pain and numbness. Someone is blaming you for causing most of your own problems and the bad things that happen to you yourself causing drama and fights in your love connections see somebody is turning others against you scapegoating you you know they're a fucking ass it's all they're saying it's been unintentional but People were sending you the evil eye with their words and their actions. They've been scapegoating you. They've been blaming you, saying you're your worst own enemy. You are causing this all to yourself. But the thing is, the point of the matter is they've scapegoated you. So they've blamed you. They're saying the bad things that happened to you is by your own doing, but they did it. Someone has an unhealthy obsession with you. You need to protect yourself. And this is like Palo Santo. Beware of anyone from the past re-entering your life. They're always, this is a copycat, competing with you. Always trying to one-up you. So they've made you the fucking scapegoat. Okay, they've done some shit here, Sagittarius. I don't know if this is your family making you the scapegoat. Saying, you know, you're your worst own enemy. You, you're you bringing this all upon yourself. You deserve this. You deserve that. No. No. They were competing with you, trying to one-up you, spreading shit about you and scapegoating you, making you the scapegoat for their own fucking miserable lives. You need to keep saging yourself. Maybe even keep some pyrite or it's a family member hating on you. They're saying it's it's not intentional, but a resentment is here. Resentment, hatred. What the fuck? They can't stand seeing you shine. I've been getting this message for you for several days now. So it's their own words like... They may not realize how powerful words can be. They may not realize how powerful their actions and their words have been. They have blamed you, scapegoated you, made it appear, trying to turn others against you. And there is a male figure that's coming through saying we know you we know the truth i know the truth we know the truth these people this family member has been busy trying to turn everyone else against you scapegoating you 
and being cocky about it, saying, oh, Sagittarius is their worst own enemy. They have done this to their own lives. Blah, 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 blah. Know it all. They're a know it all. It's their cutting words. It's what they did. They were competing with you. They couldn't stand to see you shine, so they turned everyone else against you. And, and the whole time going, they're setting this up, they're causing this, and then turning around and saying you're your worst own enemy. You've done this all to yourself. You deserve this. You made this happen. You're responsible. No, it was their fucking ignorance. Sorry. They don't have a clue what the hell they're talking about, Sagittarius. They're looking for a scapegoat. So who better to blame so eliminate Sagittarius, get Sagittarius out of the way so that they can turn everyone against you when your back is turned and then blame you for your circumstances that they created by their words and their actions. This is a feminine hater. Hating on you. I told you it's like a, a, a family generational curse. By their ignorance and the things that they have said. The things that they have spoken. It's like they didn't realize that the things they were saying were going to cause all this amount of trouble. If they're saying it was unintentional. So it's their own words and their actions. that have caused some kind of generational curse. It's like they couldn't stand to sh see you shine. They couldn't stand to see you getting attention. They couldn't stand to see you celebrated or they were jealous. And that jealousy turned to hatred. It's a very unhealthy obsession that they have had with you obsessed about trying to see you fail. They can't stand to see you shine. So inadvertently this um, bullshit here, this gossip, this slander, those words were heard by the universe. They may have cursed you. These could have been curses. Like with words. Talking shit about you, talking shit about your family. This person couldn't stand to see you happy. They couldn't stand to see you uh, build a solid foundation. They couldn't stand to see you gifted. They can't stand your gifts. They can't stand to see you shine. It's like this person wanted you in the dark. Always wanting you people to think of you in a dark way. You could have felt like you've been cursed, you know? 
You could have felt like, you know, I didn't ask to be here. I was simply born. <laughs> That's how bad it is that I'm picking up on. You may have felt like, you know, have I been cursed? I mean, this has happened to me and this has happened to me. This has happened to me. And then they turn around. They made that happen. They made that happen. They've been out to destroy you. Unintentionally, but by their words and their actions, they have done exactly that. Cursed you. It is a feminine hater. Maybe they saw you as competition. Maybe they were always trying to one-up you. Maybe they were always trying to, like, compete for attention. Or viewed you as competition somehow. Whoa. Holy shit. It's your authentic truth. It's your blessings. It's like enough's enough. It's like this person wanted you alone. They wanted you, everyone to ghost you. They didn't want you to rebirth. They didn't want you to heal. They wanted you in solitude, isolated. They got a lot to frickin' say, I can tell you that. They should shut their mouths. It's a family member. Could be a sister, could be an auntie, could be a mother. someone just out to destroy your relationships your friendships your relationships they're a hater man they're holding a fucking grudge they wanted people to reject you they wanted you to feel rejected They can also be masculine, but hate feminines. Or it is a feminine who's doing it. an unhealthy obsession with you.
so tell me spirit with knowing this information how is this going to play out for Sagittarius is Sag going to have to like carry this curse forever or, or what are you doing about this what are you doing about this spirit been lying can't stand to see you respected can't stand to see you shine Trying to turn others against you. I ask what spirit's going to do about it. What is spirit going to do about this? Something being brought to the light here. What are you kidding? Are they jealous because you had a relationship with your father? the truth it is it is have an unhealthy obsession with a family member. Has an unhealthy obsession with you, your relationships, and your family. Or it's a family member who has an unhealthy obsession with your relationships and your relationships within your family. Blessings. That's what spirits are doing. Blessing you. That's what Spirit's doing. Blessing you. Giving you blessings. and their words.
Somebody could be in regret of doing this. Karmic justice is being served. Comes around, goes around. Lord have mercy. Lying. They're lying. There are consequences now. Somebody has portrayed you, Sagittarius, as they portrayed you as that someone that is not to be trusted fuck this person has really given you a bad time sagittarius and i'm not sure you realize just how bad a time they've given you Could be a feminine who just hates other feminines. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? They want to be like the one noticed. The one who gets all the attention. Got friends like that, you sure the hell don't need enemies, Sagittarius. They're jealous. It is a family member. Could 
be a mother, it could be a sister, it could be an aunt, it could be a daughter. You've definitely, without a question, been made the scapegoat here. It's like people hung you out to dry without even getting your opinion or talking to you. Just people assuming and presuming that whatever this person said was the God honest truth. But Spirit is blessing you for it. Spirit is like almost using this as a, a footstool to uh, prove people wrong. That what they said was you were telling the truth. You were being honest. It's almost like this person didn't want anyone else to believe you or believe in you. They should be fucking ashamed of themselves out of their own um, insecurities, out of their own Hold oh, jeez, man. It's like they have gone over and above the call of duty to turn everyone against you. I'm really sorry, Sagittarius, if that's your situation, but... Spirit is blessing you. You've been a blessing. And they're just too ignorant to even know it. It's like you've spent enough time being the scapegoat. Surrender these people. You do not need them in your life. Whoever it is doing this. Spirits turning it into miracles, turning it into miraculous things, doing miraculous things in your life. My God, Saji. The whole time, they're sitting back going, well, you're your own worst enemy. You're finger wagger. You're your own worst enemy when it is fucking them that did it and set it up by their words and their actions. Take care.